We're here with the guys from Forensic Science. We've got the crime scene part. David, what are we looking at here? Okay, so this is this is an example of, of, of what we kind of the teaching we do um, here at Kiel. So uh, what we've got here is, is a pretty typical um, vehicle crime. Um, we've got a range of different evidences that we can we can actually look at, okay. um, and we're going to show you a little bit about you know what we would collect from a crime scene. So you can see um, on the handle, around the handle, um, is obviously someone's tried to get in. Uh, and we can see that we've recovered some fingerprints from there, so you, you can see you can see all of that. Um, <clears throat> the other thing we've got is often there's some way of entry, uh, some other evidence we can collect. And on the floor, if you sort of look down, you can see that we've got a, um, a, a footprint that's been cast um, in soil, uh, and you can see next to it we've got an upturned one, so you can see what it would look like uh, when it's been um, when it's been cast. Okay. Uh, just further along, um, you can see we've got some we've got some glass. Um, this is typical vehicle glass. Um, and it's very different for different makes of cars. So what we do here is collect a little bit of glass from here that we could use later as a comparison, maybe if somebody we found somebody uh, with some in their pocket, you know, as a result of the window being broken. Okay, fantastic. And so this is something that students when they come here, yeah, part of their studies. Yeah, so as, so as part of the forensic science degree, um, we, one aspect we look at is vehicle crime. So um, we, we do look at how we how we process vehicle crime. It's quite different from processing, say, an indoor scene uh, where you haven't got the wind and things blowing around. Okay, yeah. So certain things we can look for, certain things we wouldn't. Um, so, but yes, it is definitely a technique that we that we teach here at Kim. Fantastic! Thank you. Thank you very much.